What's going on everyone, Nick van Dutch here, back with another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to install Napster Premium on your iOS device for free. So if you're ready, let's start the video. Make sure to connect your iOS device with your computer and once that has been done we need to download two files so the first file is of course the impactor so if you're on a Mac the impactor uh, download that one for the Mac and if you're on a PC download the one for the PC and obviously you need to download the IPA of Napster 5.6.7 all the links are down below in the description so grab them for the system you are on once you have done that, open Impactor and then drag and drop the IPA file into it and then fill in your Apple ID and also your password. So if your normal Apple ID doesn't work, just create a new one and it should work. So you will see that it is actually installing, so this should take about a minute depending on how quick your system is. And you will also see on the right side of the screen, you will see I'm recording my iPhone screen at this moment because I'm installing on my iPhone at this time and you can also use an iPad for it and eventually once the setup has been finished you will see the Napster icon on your iPhone screen so we're gonna wait for it and it should take a couple of seconds from here on so it's signing up so Napster for the people who don't know what Napster is so when you born or around the 90s Napster was actually the founder of downloading music and it became so big that eventually it got banned, it got disappeared because it was eventually illegal because Napster was very popular by downloading free music. So maybe you are from that era and I am definitely from that era so I remember how Napster was for me. So we're gonna wait for it, it's now verifying the application. So once it has been complete, you will see on the screen right here that Napster is finished. So we're gonna head over okay, to our when iPhone. you open this one for the first time, it says you need to trust the developer. So we're gonna hit cancel, head back to settings and then um, general and then device management and then tap on the app ID which you use to sign this application. So once you have trust the app, head back and then open it. So once it opens, uh, you need to sign up or log in. I already created an account, so I'll be right back after I fill in my username and my password. There you go. So I'm gonna tap on a login with this mail. So once I have done that, I'm gonna skip this one because I already read this. And if you uh, are using this for the first time, I recommend to uh, read it first. So I'm gonna tap on settings, and as you can see here, the account type is Napster Premier. So it's the premium version of Napster. So I like this a lot, uh, and I think personally this is better than Deezer and Spotify because it is really simple. The interface is really easy and simple to use and um, better than Deezer and Spotify in my opinion. So when you ask me to make a top three of the current music players at this moment, you can get for free. Uh, I recommend Napster and then second Deezer and then number three Spotify. So as you can see here, I can uh, skip all the songs. There's no waiting time. I can shuffle play. I can uh, skip forward to it. So there's no limitation with this uh, premium version. So uh, as you can see here, I can do everything what I can. I'm gonna tap on a uh, favorite. So here you go. I'm gonna skip this one also, speeding forward, and this one also to my favorite. So I'm gonna show you how this actually works. So I just um, put a couple songs in my favorite list. So what I'm gonna do is gonna head back to our screen, gonna tap on the main menu, go to my music, and then you can see the library and then your favorites right over here. When you tap on favorites, it will automatically download it for you. So you don't have to do it separately. So when you tap on download, you will see the songs are available. So I'm gonna turn off my Wi-Fi, and as you can see, I'm on airplane mode, and I'm gonna also kill my app on the background. So when I tap uh, on Napster, when I open this one from the background, uh, sorry, uh, from a, a fresh start, you will see that without any internet connection, I can still have access to my songs, which I placed in my favorite list, which already been downloaded for me. And here you go, I can play them over and over again and without any waiting time or downloading time. So that makes this a very easy comparing to the Deezer one and the Spotify premium. So this is absolutely my favorite so far. 
and it depends on what you actually want in a music player so there you have it napster for your ios device i hope you enjoyed this video nick van Dutch signing out